morning everybody and in today's video we're going to be painting my calipers on my 2003 g35 coupe the first thing we need to do to get started is to take off the wheels in the back now we've jacked up the car we're going to take off the bolts in a star pattern mom coming in clutch with the light thank you mom Man, these wheels are dirty i gotta clean these up now just take off the wheel all these nuts over here. I love nuts. Oh, look at this beef boy. Right here. I need new tires. Okay. Next thing we need to do is clean the brakes. They're dirty as hell. I, this is my first time doing this, guys. This is my first time doing it. And uh, I'm pretty sure you're not supposed to be using Clorox wipes, but I don't care. Y'all see that? Shoot. Ah! Shout out to mom. Yo, shout out to my mom, man. Shout out to my mom for um, whipping this lighting setup up. This is like dream lighting setup, man. You need some lighting? Boom. Lighting? Boom. Right there. Boom. 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 And then over there, whatever. Who cares about that, you know? All right, guys. First things first. We're going to sand these little I would recommend wearing a mask as well. Now that we're done with the 320 grit, we're gonna clean this all up and then get it prepped. We're gonna tape up everything surrounding the caliper so that we don't get any overspray. I think everything's perfectly set up. This is my preparation, this is my prep. It's a guarantee that no overspray gets on my car or gets in any unnecessary place that I don't want it to be. I think this is perfect. I think I did a good job. And uh, this might be a bit overboard, but personally, I think this is just enough to protect your car. Even though my paint job isn't the best, um, I still don't want to deal with the overspray and stuff. Last step is to tape up the Brembo. Guys, look, my mom brought me peanuts. Yo, that was tiring, man. I'm dead. Now, you gotta shake the can vigorously for a minute. All right, guys. So, the first spray. All right, y'all. So, the first spray, it's gonna be very, very light coats. Like, very light. You know what I mean? Very light. This is funny, man. I'm, I'm talking like I, if I know what I'm doing. <laughs> Give some test sprays to the side. All right, it works. All right, let's get it. Coat number two. All right, it's been 10 minutes. The third spray. On the third spray, I believe you can go a little bit, uh, a little bit heavier. Cool. Hey guys, Chris Fix here. In today's video, we're gonna be painting our calipers. No, I wish I was Chris Fix. That'd be sick. Eric Fixes. Hey guys, it's Eric Fixes. <laughs> we're gonna ask for the fourth coat. All right, yo. So like my camera died. It didn't record me spraying the clear coat. So I'm gonna explain what you. Well, I'm, I'm gonna explain what I did. So basically, what I did was I used this metallic um, clear coat. It's a metallic pro clear coat to give it this pearlescent effect. I did three coats. I did three coats of clear, 15 minutes apart. It didn't come out perfectly because I think something's wrong with the clear coat because. Oh shit! Jump. You're back. The floor. You're back. I know. Shut up. Shut up. It looks pretty cool. I think it looks pretty cool. Okay, let's compare it to the other side, which is red. These are the red ones. Oh, I'll put my slicks back on. Let's go. I love you, Chris Fix. My name is Chris. Also, Chris Fix. I'm cutting that out of the video. What? My name is Chris Fix. <laughs> these big boys are deep clean too make these nice and clean again get these bad boys clean Beautiful. oh my god 
Look at that. Peace. Let's get these brakes cleaned up. So I can't get this off properly. I'm just gonna sand it off to be honest. Who cares? It's gonna get dirty anyways, you know? Damn, these shits are rusty. Why are these so rusty? Let's clean this up and let's get this masked up and taped up and get it ready for painting. The best thing you possibly do is getting a, a wax and grease remover for like the final prep. But I don't have that and I don't want to go get it even though AutoZone is two minutes away from my house. I'm using hand sanitizer. Hand sanitizer has 75% alcohol. I don't know what else it has in it, but I tried it last time and it worked. Masking. Done. Now I'm done masking up the car. Looks pretty sick. That's the setup. It's It wasn't as good as the one I had in the back, but oh well, who cares? All right, now we're done with everything. Let's start painting. First coat done, second coat. Last and final coat, baby. Let's get it. Beautiful, it looks sick. Now, for the clear coat. So it looks, after the final coat, you see a lot of orange peel, but after we let it dry for a couple days, or for two days, I'll wet sand it. Damn. So since this color is very, it's flat, uh, I love metallic colors. So what I got is this tubi color, uh, Extreme Pearl Finish, which is, um, it basically consists of purple, blue, pink, and flakes. It looks like if you were to get, like grab a, a handful of sprinkles, like different colored sprinkles or glitter, and just toss it on. That's how it looks. Done. Spray coat number two. Boom. <laughs> That's all for today, folks. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you guys did, hit the like button. Comment, subscribe. Thank you guys so much. Love you guys. One more thing. Have a beautiful day.